Hello friends, welcome to Mathematica Tutorial 8. I received a request regarding partial differential equation solution and its introductions. So in mathematics, a partial differential equation is a differential equation that contains unknown multivariable functions and their partial derivatives. PDs are used to formulate problems involving functions of several variables and are either solved by hand or used to create a relevant computer model. A special case is an ordinary differential equation which deals with a function of a single variable and their derivatives. We have seen the ordinary differential equation in a great detail in our previous videos. So today I will introduce the partial differential equation. As I said, here is one dependent variable y and two independent variable t. The y, the derivative of y depends on t as well as x and thus it forms the basis of partial differential equation. In Unlike in ordinary differential equation, there was only one independent variable and one dependent variable. Okay, The degree of any ordinary differential equation or partial differential equation can be determined by highest degree of derivative. So here you can see there is only one derivative so it is first order partial differential equation. Okay, the solution of any differential equation can be obtained by dissolve or n dissolve. We have seen in our previous videos. Similar trick we will apply here to solve first order partial differential equation. So as I said, there are two derivatives. Uh, one is uh, of time and one is of x. Okay, so we'll have to supply two boundary condition. Okay, so these are arbitrary boundary condition I have chosen okay, just for the ease of demonstration and further I will show you uh, several kind of complicated differential equations and uh, if examples of partial differential equations are heat equation, wave equation as well as diffusion equation. These three equations are very, very basic and widely used to model any system okay so let me move to the solution of first order partial differential equation so to solve any uh, code in Mathematica you need to press shift and enter this is the particular format and syntax that you need to remember okay and this is particular command to plot the solution of partial differential equation or any differential equation so let me press shift and enter you can see here this is the output okay the x axis is your x okay and the y axis is the output of your partial differential equation here i used d solve command d is used for differential and solve mean by solve so this is basically used for solving differential equation analytically okay now we'll show that the similar results can be obtained by and dissolve method okay so we'll plot both the results simultaneously okay just to demonstrate both method works together and both method works in a similar way okay press shift and enter here you can see the output of d solve and the output of nd solve is same okay so there are two ways to solve any first order partial differential equation in mathematica first is d solve and second is n d solve the very basic difference between n d solve and d solve is only this part here you have to specify that y which is your dependent variable is a function of x and t these are two independent variables okay here you need not to specify here you have to show only your independent variable and you have to give the range of your independent variables and plotting syntax is the same for both okay so this is the basic introduction of solution of first order partial differential equation so in the next tutorial we will see complicated differential equation that will be second order partial differential equation and the complication will be introduced by using the second order derivative in time and second order derivative in space so by this way it will form a basis of wave equation so we will solve a wave equation in next tutorial
okay guys i would like to stop this demonstration here if you like the video press the like button if you have any question a query or any comment please leave your comment if you have any specific query if you want me to solve for you something then please write down in comment box and if you haven't subscribed my channel please subscribe the channel and also press the bell icon to see latest video notification i would like to express my big thanks to you all guys for watching the video thank you so much for watching